This is Coach Greg. Say hi to Coach Greg. Hi, how are you? He is a bodybuilder. He came out with his new digital cookbook. There is no printed version and it's only $140. Oh my goodness. Hey YouTube, I am back. Thanks for clicking on this video. Lots of creators are sharing their reviews, thoughts and opinions on Greg Doucette's new Anabolic Cookbook 2.0. I actually really like Greg Doucette. I have absolutely nothing against Coach Greg. I just do not have the money to spend on an ebook. As always, all creators shown are linked down below in the description box. Lastly, to the people who want to complain that it's too expensive, then don't buy it. No one's forcing you to buy it. I swear to Sky Daddy, if anybody comes up to me and says, this is too expensive, I'm going to complain about it. I never told you to purchase my stuff. Don't be a dummy. Don't buy things that are too expensive for you. What a weird thing to complain about. With that said, I totally get the idea of wanting something high in volume and therefore satiating, but at the same time low in calories. During my so-called research, I came across this Dutch creator. Her name is Carlo and she considers herself a Greg Doucette fan. She's making a very easy and basic version of protein fluff and that was my starting point for me playing around with casein powder. So that is what we're doing today. Please enjoy the video. Oh! <laughs> that was so stupid! That was... <laughs> How to not make it? <laughs> oh, it's so stupid. Did I say it's stupid? My God. This is my first take on this easy protein fluff. All you need is frozen fruit and casein powder. In my case, I used strawberries and a vanilla flavored casein powder. Start with blending the fruit in a blender or a food processor. This may take some time. If you encounter problems with blending the fruit, adding a dash of water could actually help. At this point you could add sugar, honey or other sweeteners, but the casein powder has artificial sweetness in it, at least mine does, so I think it is sweet enough, at least for me. If you stop now, there you go, you've made strawberry sobe. Now I am adding the casein powder. Once it is fully incorporated, this takes about a minute. You could stop again, congratulations, you've made quick strawberry ice cream. But the fun part is, the longer you whip it, 
the more air gets incorporated and basically the fluffier it gets. After two and a half minutes, we're done. Voila! Two ingredient strawberry vanilla 